Ordering numbers with negative exponents. We're asked to order some sets of numbers here by using less than, greater than, or equal to, but they all have negative exponents. So before I can compare them to see which one is greater or less than, it would be nice to just get rid of those negative exponents. So what we can do is recall that if we have a fraction being raised to a negative exponent, we can change that into a fraction raised to a positive exponent if we just take the reciprocal or flip the fraction. So the original a over b raised to a negative exponent gets flipped to be b over a raised to now a positive exponent. So let's rewrite each one of these to get rid of those negative exponents. Now a couple of these don't have denominators, they're not written as a fraction, but 7 can be 7 over 1, so I can do that to make each one of these a fraction. And then to get rid of the negative, I can flip it so that this one becomes 1 over 7 squared. I flipped it and made it positive. And the one to the right of it, that one will also flip, but it will become 7 over 1 squared. So I made both of those positive exponents. And now I can evaluate those 1 over 7 squared is going to be 1 squared or 1 over 7 squared 49 and on the other side it's going to be 7 squared 49 over 1 squared which is 1. So I've actually ended up with 1 over 49 on the left and 49 over 1 on the right. 49 is greater than 1 over 49 so I'm going to put my sign in there and then we'll just do the same for the other expressions. The next one down is 1 over 7 to the negative 1 is 7 over 1 to the negative 1 which will be 1 over 7 raised to the positive 1 and then the other side gets flipped 7 over 1 now those are both positive exponents so I've got 1 7th and 7 over 1 is just 7 so that's also going to be going this way because the larger one is on the right hand side and then the last one 7 over 1 raised to the positive 1 power and 1 over 7 raised to the positive 2 power evaluating the one on the right uh, well, evaluating the one on the left is 7 over 1 to the first, that's just 7. And on the right, 1 squared is 1, 7 squared is 49. So this time the larger one is on the left. So I'm going to draw that line the other way. And there you go. We've compared each one of them by getting rid of the negatives and then evaluating so that we have these comparisons which are much easier.